Hi, this is Rob coming to you from the Mishimoto Engineering Facility. If you haven't already, subscribe to our YouTube channel and like us on Facebook for more exclusive content. Today, we're going to install our catback exhaust system on your 2015 EcoBoost Mustang. This is a pretty simple install, so we should have your pony purring in no time. Now would also be a great time to install our 3-inch high-performance downpipe. Let's get started. Tools required for installation are 13 and 15 millimeter sockets, an extension, and a 3 8 drive ratchet. Installation time is about an hour. Installation difficulty is a 3 out of 5. Warning, the stock exhaust system is one piece and very heavy. We recommend getting a friend to help with removing it. Loosen, but do not remove the two 15 millimeter nuts that secure the coupler where the flex pipe meets the exhaust section. Remove the two 13 millimeter bolts that secure the rear exhaust hangers to the rear subframe behind the differential. Lift the exhaust system slightly and slide the hook on the front of the hanger out of the subframe. Separate the exhaust system from the flex section. Grasp the flex section and push the exhaust system straight back towards the rear of the vehicle. The stock exhaust system is heavy, so get a friend to help. Tilt the front end of the exhaust system downwards, then slide it towards the front of the vehicle and out of the hangers near the muffler. Remove the middle hangers from the stock exhaust system. Note the position of the hook on the hanger and slide them off the exhaust. Transfer the middle hangers to the Mishimoto mufflers. Make sure the hook is facing away from the mufflers. Install the front section of the Mishimoto exhaust. Snug the two 15 mm nuts that secure the coupler, but do not fully tighten them. You will need to adjust the position of the exhaust later. Install the Mishimoto Y-pipe. Locate the transition coupler in your kit and install it on the front section of the exhaust. Support the Y-pipe with a jack stand or under hoist stand and align it with the front section. Slide the coupler over the exhaust and snug it down, but do not fully tighten it yet. Install the Mishimoto mufflers. Making sure the muffler tip is clear of the rear bumper, insert the exhaust hanger into the rubber grommet. Do this on both sides. Install the rear couplers over the Y-pipe. Make sure the wider section of the coupler faces towards the mufflers. Hook the exhaust hangers into the rear subframe, but do not bolt them in yet. Slip the muffler pipe over the end of the Y-pipe, then slip the coupler over the connection. Install the bolts that secure the muffler hangers to the rear subframe and tighten them down. Make sure the Y-pipe is bottomed out in the muffler sections. Then turn the coupler so the bolts do not protrude below the exhaust system and tighten them down. Check the fitment of your exhaust. The couplers at the front of the system are still loose at this point. Adjust the exhaust until it fits properly, then tighten down the front couplers. It may be necessary to loosen the rear hangers or other connection points to make fine adjustments in the exhaust location. Once you are satisfied with the fitment, be sure to go back and tighten up anything you loosened. Now that you have the exhaust all bolted up, take a minute to check all your connections for leaks and make sure the exhaust is positioned properly at the rear bumper. There's some wiggle room in the hangers and the slip fit exhaust connections, so you may have to adjust it a bit to get it to hang properly. Then go ahead and fire it up for a test drive. Don't forget to click subscribe before you head out.